In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make vegetarian grape leaves. This is my recipe, my grandma's recipe, my mom's recipe. This is how we always made it, and it's delicious. So I'm using some parsley, mint, scallions, plum tomatoes, and a red onion. Chopping up everything super finely and dicing the tomatoes, putting them with my rice. This is basically the bule without rice. So the same ingredients you use to make the bule, you're putting them in the rice. So here I am just chopping up my parsley putting with my rice, mint, this is from my garden, and these took forever to take off the stem. Just chopping up everything, and now I'm going to add some salt, cumin, black pepper, and some dried mint leaves, two lemons, putting that in there. You're gonna add your olive oil, it's a lot of olive oil, I'm adding like a cup. Mix it up real good and get those juices in a strainer, you're gonna strain up your mixture. And then at the bottom of your pot, you're gonna add any vegetable you want. I got tomatoes, potatoes, carrots, I'm throwing them all in there on the bottom. So when you line up your grape leaves, they don't burn. So I'm using a jar of grape leaves. This recipe calls for one jar and you'll have some of the grape leaves left over. You can add some more rice if you'd like. And this is how you're gonna roll them. You're gonna put some of the mixture right in the middle and then you're gonna roll them up, you fold both sides and you just roll them up. It's super easy, super quick. This is how I do it super fast. So I clear out my island counter and I just put all the grape leaves on the counter and I just roll, roll, roll. I typically do a whole jar in literally 10 minutes because once you get into the rhythm of it, it gets super, super easy. You can get someone to help you out by placing them on the counter and then you just put the mixture and roll. So I rolled everything out, put it in my pot, put more vegetables on top. Now I'm adding more olive oil, more lemon juice, more cumin into the mixture that I strained, more salt, salt to taste. And then you're going to fill it up with water so you can fill the pot up. I'm putting some grape leaves that came extra on top. I'm putting a plate. You need a plate weight so the grape leaves don't open up when they're cooking. And I have a teapot, the Arab style, on top of the plate. And then I'm going to fill up water until it touches the top of the plate. I had this on the stove for literally three and a half hours, four hours. It depends on the grape leaves. And here is the finished product. The recipe is going to be in the caption. Ask me any questions that you have for more help.